Every year, the Dominican Republic celebrates its Independence Day on February 27th. But do you know what's behind that date? How did the Dominican people succeed in their long struggle for freedom? The history behind the Dominican Republic's struggle for independence is one of the most extraordinary and convoluted ones in the Americas. For starters, the Dominican Republic is one of the few countries in the world that have fought and won their independence twice. First from Spain in 1821 and then from Haiti in 1844. It's the second one that Dominicans celebrate every February 27th, as that was the date in 1844 when a secret society known as La Trinitaria, the Trinity, started the independence war against the Haitian regime. However, that's not all. The islands that's today divided into two countries, the Dominican Republic and Haiti, have been called La Hispaniola by the Spaniards since the time of Christopher Columbus. It was the Spaniards' first settlement in the Americas, and it grew in importance during the first century of Spanish rule. Nevertheless, the situation changed when gold was discovered in Mexico and Peru. By 1697, the Spaniards lost the western side of the island, Haiti, to the French, and by 1795, the whole island. By 1814, the Spaniards recaptured the eastern side of the island, only to lose it again due to the first successful independence of the Dominican Republic, which was hoping to join the Dominican Republic of Gran Colombia. But this project never materialized, and in 1822, Haiti conquered the whole island. Haiti remained in power for 22 years until February 27, 1844, when Dominicans finally won their independence for good. If you follow closely, you've noticed that over the last 500 years, the Dominican Republic was under the rule of Spain, France, Spain again, and Haiti. No wonder Dominican people celebrate their independence for a whole month every year. Although Dominican people celebrate their independence day on February 27th every year, the whole month of February is known as Patriotism Month. Celebration starts on January 26th with the commemoration of the birth of national hero and founding father, Juan Pablo Duarte. Throughout the month, Dominicans celebrate their history, culture, and heritage. And here comes a cool twist. Since Carnival takes place in the same month, they include it in their independence celebration, which has to make it one of the most unique Independence Day celebrations in the world. On February 27th, Dominicans pay tribute to their founding fathers at the Puerta del Conde in Santo Domingo. The president of the country gives a speech broadcasted to the whole nation and people hang Dominican flags from their balconies and eat traditional dishes such as bacalao and mangu. Finally, Dominicans celebrate carnival style on the streets of every town in the country. But especially in La Vega, a city located 120 kilometers north of the capital city of Santo Domingo. Here, the festive mood and patriotic pride of Dominicans mix to produce a celebration of legendary portions. As with most Latin American countries, the national flag of the Dominican Republic was created during their War of Independence. It makes sense as that was the time when the idea of new nations swept the continent. The flag was the idea of Dominican national hero Juan Pablo Duarte and designed by two women, Concepcion Bona and Maria Trinidad Sanchez. It was flown for the first time in 1844. The design of the flag introduces a white cross in the center, just as in other Christian nations, and four rectangles in dark blue and red. In the center of the cross appears the Dominican coat of arms. Designed by Dominican politician Casimiro Nemeseo de Moya, the official coat of arms of the Dominican Republic features a shield with this combination of colors of the flag, blue, red, and white with six spears, a yellow cross, and the Bible open to John 8.32, Y la verdad os hará libres, and the truth shall make you free. A laurel branch and a palm frond are on either side of the shield. Below it, a red ribbon bears the name of the country in yellow, and above the shield, the national motto, Dios, Patria, Libertad, God, Fatherland, Liberty, and that's it for today on the History for Dominican Independence Day.